Hey you guys, good morning. This is Danielle Nicole. We're going to go and start upstairs and then work our way down the stairs. If you're new, welcome. If you're old, welcome back. Subscribe, like if you like this type of video. If you've been following me for a while, these items I got thrifting for, I think, maybe, I want to say like $10 a piece. Um, and they came from my condo. And these pictures here are thrifted items as well. There's two pictures in the set. And I'm not sure, like, where I got them from. I believe they're hand-me-downs from my mom. So, you know, it more than likely, uh, she didn't pay much money because she's even thriftier than I am. And then along this wall is an oldie but goodie. It's from one of those. It's an oil painting, actually. And I don't know if you guys remember, like, back in the day, people used to do art shows in the home. It was kind of, like, similar to Tupperware parties where they would sell art and artwork in their home, set it up in their living room. They would usually have it over their friend's house, invite people over, and then we would have snacks and then order paintings usually they weren't prints usually they were oil paintings like this so this is also um some pictures that i got from my office and they are landscape items it's four pictures it's two in here and two in the hallway right here and it's the pretty much the seasons of the year spring autumn fall winter so we're gonna go to um this hallway here because i don't think i showed you guys uh this is the eight dollars for this picture eight dollars for that picture these are the other two landscaping photos um well i should say oil paintings and these items are a lot of them are thrifted it's a good fit with this style i don't think it's too contemporary I kind of want to try to make it look like it was actually a set. And the bottom reminds me of an organ. And the fact that these right here, these lines kind of tie into that a little bit. So, yeah, um, this is finally my dining room table, which has taken me maybe like four or five months to find. And that lovely mirror is, um, I have to figure out where I'm going to put it. That at one point was in my bathroom and my basement at my other place. Now these chairs that I'm sitting in, I, um, it came with a table, but I didn't need the table. So what I did with the table was I donated, no, donated the table back. And it's an organization that uh, deals with people that have substance abuse, they're homeless and just it helps people get jobs training so it's a good organization a lot of their proceeds go towards that so acosta is where i got the table from is a consignment shop for furniture only and furniture furniture and home accessories and it's the chairs here that i got are from jubilee wall hangings i'm really limited because i don't really have a whole lot of wall space so we picked up these little pictures they were more money than i really normally spend i think they were like ten dollars a piece which was highly robbery um but they fit that most of the pictures are either too small or too big um but i think that's it <gasps> don't you hate when you're trying to go somewhere and you forget your keys or you lost your keys. I'm looking for my keys so that we can go. Chat, you seen my keys? Of course, you, of course not, you too busy sleeping. <sighs> so I'm calling my mother to see if I left my keys in her 
center console in her car. But I still got a lot of stuff packed up and I don't know where my spare keys are. All I have is a key that will just allow me to unlock the car, but I can't start the ignition. So we don't have to postpone this and go somewhere uh, later on. Unless she bring in my key. This is Jubilee, the furniture store I told you about that helps people with substance problems. Acosta was closed, so Jubilee has like really late hours, so um, I will have to vlog in that store during another video. So as you can see, they have a lot of gently used items. They are open Wednesday through Saturday. Now, this particular day, I'm looking for something in my office to sit on. Not for me to sit on, but if somebody were to come into my office, it can't be super big because I already have a lot of stuff in there and it's a small room. So, any suggestions?